All right, guys, James the River Lunacy. We're on the Ohio River. PJ, we got PJ with us. Uh, he just had a rod go down. Fishing a um, channel ledge with some rock right now. Um, got some fresh cut shad. We just got in the water. Let me cut some bait up and we'll be back. Down and a few in the middle and then on the way up here. There you go. I'm letting it pull. Yep, good. Fish on. Woo, he's got it. All right. PJ got him one, guys. We just anchored up in a uh, creek mouth here, checking things out. Seen a few fish on the way down and well on the way up and a few in the middle. Looked like a catfish species to me. Got that beautiful warm sun right in the way of the camera going to mess up our video but uh you got to deal with what you got so hopefully as the day goes it'll move on over to the right and won't bother us so much but we're breaking that skunk so that's a good thing didn't take long either A big old channel cat? Son of a gun it is. <laughs> we was just talking about channel cats last night. You don't see too many big ones anymore. That's a pretty good size one. Well, it's a skunk buster. That's funny. He wasn't playing around. Good. A little mud on the belly. Oh yeah. Oh, it's all muddy, ain't he? Yeah, he didn't burp. He got a pipe. Uh, yeah, we're gonna let the air out of this fish, guys. He's uh, come out of 40 foot of water, so we'll be back with another one, hopefully. a little troublemaker. Wow, he's a little one too. I don't even know what his little butt was doing down there. I should eat him just for doing that. <laughs> I should eat him for doing that. I do eat fish sometimes. It's going to be a little while before I get home, so I'm going to let him go. A good one there. I'm gonna get this one out of there. Yep, that's a good fish. <laughs> he put the brakes on, man.
It's all yours. I didn't do nothing but pull that rod up. I ain't even crank on him. Barely. Feel like a solid little youngster there. <laughs> Maybe we just need to move out a little bit. We seem to be further out in the ledge. A little better replacement possibly. Might help us out some. How you doing? Right under, he's underneath it. He's pretty far back there. Yeah, he's in between mine and yours. He's coming up now. That's a good fish. Yeah. If you put a little pressure to the left, he'll miss yours, hopefully. Okay, I see. Uh, he might swim back down. It's gonna be tricky right there. <laughs> Massive current here. You might have to go under mine and over yours. There you go. Yep, over them too. And then underneath that one on the right. I think you got him. Yeah. Clean that mess up quick. What'd he do? Come up and grab it anyway? <laughs> it makes me wonder if that's the same one I lost. I, I doubt it. I hope not because it's making me want to move out a little bit better. Good deal, guys. A little better fish here. Put the hammer down, that's for sure. That hook one coming out, solid right there. Trophy cat hooks, guys. Green guy. Contact PJ right here. Trophy cat tackle company. If you're new, it's where all my tackle comes from. This is his fish. Get another one out of here. Get a bite. Throw something in my butt. Oh, it's gonna go. Uh oh, it's gonna go. Oh, fast drag. <laughs> Hell yeah. <laughs> it's not real loose. If he is in the current. I guess I better hold on to my rod. He's gonna try to take me for a little ride. <laughs> 
that head wobble stuff. Yeah, that one, that last one, he was doing that really crazy. Yeah, that's how they pop them hooks out. They start doing that. to me and staying down got his brakes on Get a nice side view of that rod for that thumbnail <laughs> I like that one. Yeah, I've, seen, I've seen some people comment on the thumbnail how they like the guys video yeah. thumbnails that get me any views is when I've got the rod sideways and bent over. That's what you should name the, the video. Should be staying down and not spinning up into all the stuff. We're in about three and a half miles of current here. Throw the anchor back down. We moved up from where we were. Hit the old Carolina rig. Just the good old regular rig that catches fish. Oh, he's got that in that corner though. Ah, don't you dare. I know what he's doing. He's going to try to slap me in between the legs. <laughs> One of them kind of make you cry when they do that. Either that or them big giant ones they hit you in the side of the head. That is a good sized fish though. Nice one. Big hard belly on him. Come out of 57 foot of water. Probably gonna have to let some air out of this guy's stomach. We'll try to take care of these fish and make sure they go back down. Be back. Oh. Yep, yeah, better just do it. Fish on. <laughs> Structure. Feels like it's some fish. Yeah. It looks like it. He's happy. Yeah. I thought he'd do that up in the air. He'd come down and hit me on the head. <laughs> <laughs> Got one. <laughs> We didn't even get all the rods in, he's already catching the fish. It's hard to tell when there's a bunch of current. The current's not real bad. Not here. But, uh, I mean, there's some, yeah. We got a bunch of trees and crap just kind of broke loose. All of a sudden, out of nowhere, so. Probably gonna fight a little bit of that. I might have to keep an eye out on the front of the boat. We didn't even get all the rods in, and there's a fish going down. That's a good. That's a. <clears throat> there's some big stuff coming out. Yeah. It's a good sign when that happens. Let's get this camera over on him a little better. Yeah, I can get that. fish yeah solid hard fighter that's for sure there you go oh that's a good one smoked it
that's the kind of takedowns we want to see. <laughs> yeah, I was just looking over to check that rod because it looked like it was on something and this one went down. I knew this was going to be good. That's a hard hitter right there. Did a good job. Did a good job. No playing. one big tree way back there but in front of it there was still a bunch of other structure and some little dips so I kept on going and then uh, once it started to clear up a little bit I shut the motor off and uh, we anchored up so we can kind of call some of them fish out of all of it plus we're still got our bait in the beginning of all the structure going on through nice solid fish It's a little bigger. Well, getting bigger. Yeah, he's a stud when he took that rod down, though. <laughs> he, yeah. he looked at it and was like, nope, I'm having it. <laughs> Fishing this one big giant chunk of debris here. Probably like a tree that's covered in crap. It's one big chunk of junk, you know. Sometimes that's all it takes to catch a fish. Youngster got some mud on him hiding in the trees. My little, luckily, my little girl, and yeah, I had a salami sandwich. Yeah. Oh. Oh, boy. I'll try to eat my salami sandwich. PJ about the fresh salted rye bread. On these sandwiches today. It's 
salami, hot pepper cheese, and stone ground brown mustard. I had to tell you all that because my dad, he'll like that. I'm sure if you look in the comments, he'll be in there if you want to talk to him. got a big head on him. Or he's hooked in the side like the other one acting big. <laughs> but no matter his size, I'm happy to have him. like my medium heavy rod. Definitely a fun rod to catch fish on any size. This is one of the old ones. We PJ just got some new ones in. A new series of them. Look a little more firm. That's what he's using on the other side of the boat. He's trying to, he's twisting it. There we go. Not a bad fish. He's a mean one. We'll let him go before he causes some problems. Fat little guy. down in this little strip of trees here. <coughs> nice. Almost had a double. They're pulling them down like big fish. Yeah. 
still haven't seen any bubbles. That's a bigger one. Yeah. Better fish. Looks like a good fish. Yeah, it's a solid fish. Come on, stay on there. Don't you do that. Came forward to try to yeah. spit it. Back that off. <coughs> that was quick. Yeah. Perfect scenario. Perfect storm right there. Drop off with a nice bunch of junk all over it. Doing, pal? Get your brakes on. <laughs> you don't want to come up. <coughs> He's got his brakes on. He wants to pull. He wants to pull. I don't want him to come up yet. We're not real deep. I mean, we're at 31 to 25 foot comes up at the top of the slope at 23. Yeah, he's not a bad fish. Darn. He's, he might be a little bigger than I think. I need to get myself get this rod down to where I can get a hold of it a little better. He's a fighting machine. <laughs> He wants to he wants to go over there. He put the brakes on. No 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 no. I thought he just went in here flying upstream on. on me real fast all of a sudden. Got tired of fighting. Right, that drag is not loose. Pulled the back end of the boat around. He's tricky, man. He is. Uh, I don't think he's a gigantic fish, but he's the strongest. He is strong. He just stops when he wants. See how he's doing right now? He just stopped. He put them brakes on. Yeah. And then he kicked out. <clears throat> he's probably been caught before. high and then he wants to drive back down that's what he's doing he's coming up high putting the brakes on and then he's driving straight down making me think he's going to come off he's a he's a good fighting fish yeah well that's, that's a nice good one. one it's a nice fish stay 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 Oh, <laughs> <laughs> me hold that 
Rob. Yeah. I need to keep pressure on him. I can't tell. I think that hook is buried in his corner. Yeah, he's buried. Oh, he's a fat fish. Buried that hook, guys. Scared me. I couldn't see it. That's because he had it buried so far back. I couldn't see it. That's a good size fish. Best fish of the day, that's for sure. Oh, oh, oh. See him curling that? That's how they look when they're in the water and I curl their put the brakes on. <laughs> i get a little picture of this gadget. Okay, I know how to do it sometimes. <laughs> oh. That's a nice healthy fish right there. He's got some shoulders on top of there. Big old on it's gonna be the last one of the day guys sure appreciate you watching hope you enjoyed the video if you did please hit that thumbs up leave all the comments you want I'll always get back to you if you like this kind of Ohio River fishing hit that subscribe button for me so you don't miss out on any more That would be the right way to end the video. Beautiful. Got the sunset. Yeah. The rod bent. That's a good. Rods are bent. Got one rod bent. Got uh that beautiful orange clouds over there with that sun glaring through. happy to have PJ out here on the boat today. PJ is going to be busy for a little while so he's not going to get the fish. If you guys are interested in the trophy cat tackle, you can use my code RIVERLUNACY15. Affordable tackle that works. Does its job. Nice, nice little round guy to end the day. Oh, muddy feller. Yep, he was in the mud for sure. Took it down though. Alright guys, thanks again for watching. We'll see you next time. Hope you enjoyed the video.